Hi everyone, in today's video, I'll show you how to create a Windows 11 bootable USB drive using a free tool called Rufus. For this, you'll need two things, a USB drive with at least 8GB of storage and a computer to set it up. Let's get started. First, we need to download the official Windows 11 ISO file. You can get it directly from Microsoft's website, the link is in the descriptions. Once you're there, scroll down to the download Windows 11 disk image ISO, click on the drop down, and let's select Windows 11 multi edition ISO for x64 devices. Then click on confirm. Next, choose your language from the menu, click on confirm, and then click on the 64 bit download button. The ISO is about 5.4 GB in size. So depending on your internet speed, it may take a while. And now we need to download the Rufus tool. Let's go to the official Rufus website. I left the link down in the descriptions and download the latest version. Since Windows 11 only runs on 64 bit system, make sure to grab the Windows X64 version. Open Rufus Then plug in your USB drive into the computer Rufus should detect it automatically Just double check that it is the right one since it will be erased From the boot selection drop down Choose disk or ISO image Then click select And browse for the Windows 11 ISO you downloaded For image option, leave it as standard Windows installation. For partition scheme, choose GPT. This is required for Windows 11. Now MBR won't work on modern PCs. And now click on start. A pop-up will appear asking about Windows user experience. Since we're just making a normal bootable USB drive, make sure to uncheck everything and click on OK. Another warning will pop up saying your USB drive will be formatted. Click OK to continue. And now Rufus will create your Windows 11 bootable USB. This will take few minutes, so just sit back and relax. Once it's done, you see you're ready. You can then close Rufus and safely eject your USB drive. And that's it. You now have Windows 11 bootable USB drive you can use it to install Windows 11 on any supported PC or laptop. I hope that was useful. Please like and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching.